When I've got an audience, I say, oh, I've got a coin, I'm going to flip it. What's the probability this is going to be heads? And they say, oh, 50-50. And that's known as aleatory uncertainty, also chance. And then I flip it, woo, like that, and cover it up. And then I say, what's your probability this is heads? Well, I look at the coin. And they, ooh, you know, they're a bit grudging because now it's fixed. It's just that they don't know what it is. But eventually they might say, oh, I suppose it's still 50-50. And that's called epistemic uncertainty, what you don't know. It's a measure of your ignorance. And then, of course, I reveal the coin and, uh, and then irritate them by pointing out that it is a two-headed coin. Even that 50-50 judgment they made at the beginning, before I flipped the coin, they made that with such confidence. But it was completely wrong. What they did was trust me. They believed that it was a standard coin. And what that shows is that any probabilities we give to any events are always based on an element of judgment and assumptions, and that those might be wrong.